everybody. So it's me. How y'all doing? I found some 55 gallon drum food grade barrels for water. I'm on my way to get them. I'm going to get as many as I can fit in my van. Uh, and they're reasonably um, inexpensive. So as long as they'll hold water, we'll be good. I'm excited. Uh, on my way there now. Well, that went really well. I was able to fit six inside my van, so that's a lot. Alrighty then, super excited. Alright, so that's over 300 gallons, super stoked, and uh, let's see what else. Yeah, like fucking egg. Okay, that's more than one of those big totes, ones. and it's separate, so. Uh, yeah, super happy about that. Woo woo! Here they are. Here they are. So, alright, I'm gonna head back home now. Well, I need to, I might stop off and like rinse them out because they're really sticky. They had some sort of cherry liquor syrup in them. So, uh, other than that, they're definitely water, you know, uh, safe. Okay, so it's the next day. I just left the car wash. I sprayed them all off. Man, my hands are so cold. Yeah, I thought they would use hot water, but they did not. But it still came off. Pressure wash is gonna get just about anything off. So, uh, got all the cherry syrup out of them. Squirted a little Dawn in there before I started, you know. Rinsed them out really, really well. Um, on my way back to camp, I might stop and try to fill a couple of them halfway up because the full one will weigh almost 500 pounds. So, yeah, that's not ideal. I can't lift that much. But, uh, <laughs> so, well, I thought about taking um, a video of me washing them out, but the water was going everywhere. I didn't want to risk getting my phone wet. So, uh, yeah, super happy. Just gotta start collecting water again. Or some more more water now I can actually collect collect water now like I have lots of containers to collect water in but you know, it's like where are you gonna put it all I really don't want to have a bunch of five gallon buckets all over the place so you know but it is what it is be back hey so Got some of them filled up some way because you know too heavy and I won't be able to move it. But I thought I would show you the camper. There's my camper. And if you can tell, I'm cleaning up a lot. Worked on the chicken coop. And I got chickens. I got six chickens. So, this is the camper. Got a pretty good deal on her. Other than the water tank, everything seems to work fine. Um, I think the pump works too. It sounds like it works. But, oh, and these are the tanks I bought. I got six of them. There's three more in the van. Right now I'm going to get them up on this porch and that way they'll have a little height on them and uh, go from there um, we'll see hopefully it'll maybe it'll hopefully it'll hold it I think it'll hold it it can hold two people it can hold one of those at least full and uh, I do have my little rain catcher bowls for all the animals so they can have plenty of water but today I'm gonna do this then I'm gonna get to work uh, tilling so I guess 
Stop it. He's still learning to leave the chickens alone. But, uh... this out. I'll do a time lapse. Well, I got it all done. I got all of them. I got one full, pretty much, and then a little bit in another one. And now I just gotta start working on filling them up. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Know you can grow. Blessed be.